This is SAT test one, calculator question number three. College Board gives you two sets of parallel lines where L and M are parallel, S and T are parallel, and angle one is given as 35 degrees. The question is, what is the measure of angle two? The shortcut is, if you look at the answers, this never says not to scale, so this is to scale. Angle two is more than 90 degrees. Choices A, B, and C are less than 90 degrees, so the correct answer must be D. Alternatively, if you actually want to use math, angle 1 is 35 degrees. So this is also 35 degrees because lines L and M are parallel. This is 35 degrees because lines S and T are parallel. And angle 2 plus 35 degrees equals 180 degrees because these two angles combined make up a straight angle. If they're supplementary, they add up to 180. Subtract 35 from both sides, and you get angle 2. The one they're asking about is 145 degrees, which is choice D. This is a common question on the SAT, asking you to find angles by using parallel lines. And we should remember this or review it from geometry. Come back soon for my next math video. With math, there's always more.